1972. Let me tell you about it. It was dirty. It was sticky. There were hotel rooms and cigarette burns. I don't even know what happened. To tell you the truth, it's like one day you're sitting out on the beach. A man comes up and offers you some Tic Tacs. The next day, you're in the county jail. They told you you thought you were a dragon. I guess I'd like to start out with a song that I wrote when I was 14 years old and I was going through some turmoil as my parents were going through divorce and there was this old shed in the backyard, you know, before they sold the house obviously and I would go into that there was an old Folgers coffee can and I would just, just bang the hell out of that can with a spoon. Yeah, I was 14, I was just, you know, sheltered, and uh, this is what I came up with. This is called uh, Ginger Booty Pumpernickel. I guess I want to start out with the song that I wrote when I was about 12 years old, and I lived in uh, Oklahoma, kind of towards the uh, tip of the handle what we like to say around Oklahoma anyway. And uh, I had a dog and the dog's name was Oscar and you know, like Oscar the Grouch because you know, Oscar liked to go through trash cans. And uh, Oscar didn't make it. He, uh, he was actually shut up in the space. It wasn't even NASA, it was just some deranged teenager with a science kit from Radio Shack. such bloodlust for unicorns and giraffe. I don't really know why I'm here. I just wanted to maybe tell a couple stories and sing a couple songs. You know, like, uh, I believe it was 1983. My parents bought me an Atari 2600, and uh, I just ended up pissing all over it, to tell you the truth. I just pissed all over it, and I didn't even, I never even played it, but I just thought, wow, I mean, can you imagine what the settlers would have thought about this as I stood over it? bare ass naked and just pissed all over. It was plugged in too. I mean it sparked up a little bit and I mean it did a little bit of fire. Not fire but smoke damage. I mean, you know I, But you know, you gotta learn. And uh <sighs> This is called Atari twenty six hundred doesn't like piss. storytelling chords. Um, it would be this, and then that one, and then this one, and then that's a G6 something or other. Um, 
anyway. So the doctor calls the other day and he says, you know, you really need to cut out the, uh, you know, the starchy foods and, you know, the PCP. And, uh, give you an example of what I can do. Thousand.